What's up logical people this is Muhammad Ammar back with a brilliant brain twister A carpenter had a rectangular wooden board He wanted to have a circular hole exactly at the center but he was drunk so he drilled the hole inaccurately of the mark just like this Now he needs your help to fix his mistake So you need to bring the hole to the exact center by using a hand saw So the objective is to cut the board into pieces and reassemble them to form a rectangle of the same dimensions as the original but with a circular hole in the exact center You should follow certain rules You can only perform straight cuts Since you're not proficient in using a saw you can only start cutting from the outer edges of the board This would be considered as a valid cut but this one is invalid because it's not starting from the outer edge The challenge is to achieve this task with a minimum number of straight cuts What is the minimum number of straight cuts required to successfully accomplish the task Now pause the video and think logically The center of the board is shown with a black dot. As I always suggest, to solve a complex problem, start with the simplest scenario. Here we can consider just a dot instead of the bigger circular hole. Now, think of a spot on this board where this dot can be misplaced, but it can be conveniently brought back to the center. It's very easy to guess. The corner spot If the dot was accidentally placed here at the exact corner then we can bring it to the center by making these two straight cuts that reach the center and now if you rotate the cut out piece by 180 degrees you'll get the dot exactly in the center now choose a little difficult case for the dot place it on the edge but somewhat away from the corner let's say x units horizontally away from the corner now if you make the same two straight cuts through the center then after rotating the cut out piece you'll get the dot away from the center by x units so to fix this issue we can initially extend our horizontal cut by x units beyond the center the vertical cut would have the same previous length but shifted by x units Now after you rotate it by 180 degrees you'll get the dot exactly at the center Finally think of a scenario where the dot is away from both edges let's say x units away horizontally and y units away vertically So the horizontal cut should extend by x units and the vertical cut should extend by y units This way we get the new cutting positions perform the two cuts and now if you rotate the cut out piece you'll get the dot exactly in the center the same logic would apply on the circular hole measure the distance from the center of the hole to the edges and extend the cuts accordingly perform the two cuts and now if you rotate the cut out piece you'll get the hole in the exact center so the hole can be recentered in just two straight cuts later i'll post a similar problem with various combinations of rules and each set of rules would lead to a different solution let's meet in the comment section to see how you guys solved it hope you guys enjoyed please like and share the video and if you are new please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to stay updated with a new logic puzzle every week till then give a try to this real time aptitude test also check out google interview puzzles on my channel logically yours